our Southside communities are coming together for an afternoon of live music, food, family activities, housing workshops, and much more at the 2024 Juneteenth Festival. Cam Brown from the Far Southside Community Development Corporation joins us now with more. And you brought some fun stuff with yes, you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Yeah, so you these are some of the vendors that are going to be uh, showcasing at the event. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Walk us through what you got. So we have four black owned businesses in the marketplace with Far South Community Development Corporation. So our first business here is owned by Melissa. This is called Craft it up. The logo for this brand is creativity has no boundaries. So custom mm -hmm. lamps, cups, tumblers, all these are custom pieces, one of ones, but she also hosts craft shops. So you can do classes learning oh, to make these lamps. Fun. And she will be at our Juneteenth event doing custom rocket ships for kids, oh. which will be all free this weekend. That's okay, so yeah. that is so is exciting. So okay, and then we have love our body here. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. So for those who love plant-based vegan items, this is a Natural product by Natural by Nat Lynette. She's the owner of this brand. So lotions, body creams, soaps, and so interesting about her creativity. These are soaps. Oh, I know. Whoa. I wasn't right. sure that that one was it? Yeah. 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 Those oh, are wow. soaps, and so she wants to make sure you can be healthy. And one of our top products is a Yanni oil. So not only looking good, that's for the vaginal for women to be healthy on the inside as well. Okay. Her top sellers, you don't want to miss it. And she'll be there this weekend as well okay. at our Juneteenth event. Okay. okay. And, and then, then we can move to hair care. Yes. So this is chair is a piece of nature. So this is a owner, Demetria. Education and cosmetology for over 20 years. She wants to make sure natural hair is important, but natural products. Mm. Synthetic free, all infused with essential oils. Mm. And this is that that gel, Ooh, you smell yes. that. Oh, oh my God. God. Yeah, that's cool. Lemon grass. Defining gel. Lemon oh, grass. Wow. That smells good. Okay, and you know, because we've been hearing yeah. a lot about products that you put on your body or in your hair yeah. end up inside your system. It can start being a disruptor and yeah. cause all kinds of problems. So this is very good. We yeah. love that. Yeah, and the ingredients, you know, like a cyclopedia, you should be less ingredients possible, the better. So that's yeah. what she understands. So this is a lifestyle these brands are promoting. Okay. okay. And yeah. then a little bit of wardrobe as well. Yeah, so we talk about fashion and faith. This is a brand by Toyin. Be original. So it's about rejected by man, but accepted by God. We know when you're in faith and trying to be spiritual, you want to look good while doing it. So no matter what barriers you have, this brand is all custom from the hats to jackets to t-shirts. And she also has custom lapels that I want to give specifically to you all today. Oh, oh lovely. Lovely. It's yeah. called Be Original. So this is a faith-based clothing brand. You can look good and have a good day with this as well. All right, let's talk a little bit yeah. about the festival. What exactly is taking place? We know you're gonna have vendors there, mm -hmm. but there's so much more going on. Talk about that. Yeah, there's a lot going on. This is a festival bringing the community together. So Juneteenth, it shows how far we come. So we talk about live food and music and fun, but not only that's for the children. So we have jumping jacks and we got petting zoo, and we also have housing workshops for those who want ownership and want to have generational wealth, a piece of their city. We have a trolley tour for that as well. So this is an event you don't want to miss, and it's free. So it's a phenomenal opportunity for people to come out. And with the home ownership, it's not just buying a new home. You're talking about rental properties too, correct? Rental properties, okay. people who rent, people who want to buy, even people who homeowners want to save money on costs, lower their taxes. So there's programs for the pre-purchase, post-purchase, and all of the above. And so these are people that are teaching you about it, or are these banks, or? Yeah, so we have a housing department at Far South Community Development Corporation, so they're teaching you about home ownership, financing, budgeting, knowing what you can afford, and mm -hmm. giving you resources. So if you want ownership, you can definitely get closer to that when you come this weekend. Okay. Talk about why it's so important to include that piece with all the fun as well. Well, one thing we talk about shopping locally, but you want to invest into your community. And so we not only want to fool your bellies, we want to make sure you fool yourself with knowledge and mm -hmm. make sure you one step closer to that piece of generational wealth. So we preach ownership and we have to practice what we preach. Talk a little bit more about the Far South Community Development Corporation. What so, do you do? So what we do in our department, I'm director of MBDC, so we support businesses through the city of Chicago. Mm -hmm. So helping these business owners thrive. This is access for stores to be, they wouldn't have any otherwise. So these small businesses is starting their home. So they mm -hmm. have access to a retail space at no cost, mm -hmm. but they understand I'm in a brick and mortar now. And there's different challenges that come with that. Okay, and then it's a learning process before you actually step out there completely on your own because this is part of a core cohort, yeah, right? Yeah, going into our fourth year, and this is new. Having mm -hmm. a storefront can be scary. Yeah. And I tell mm -hmm. my business owners, sometimes you can be here and no one shows up. Mm -hmm. But what's the process of running a business? Mm -hmm. They're great at creating products and their services, but what's the back end? So we provide services and support for them throughout the whole year, education to make sure they're sustainable business owners. And what about the what about the financial aspect of it for these for these small businesses? Are you guys giving them guidance and, and, and different um, assets that they could possibly reach from? Yes, most definitely because a lot of these businesses still have full-time jobs so they mm -hmm. don't have to leave all of that income on the table but they can still get their foot wet into the door. So they don't pay any rent, no overhead costs, but we also guiding them because ultimately once they leave our program within a year, they will have their own brick and mortar mm -hmm. and it comes with a big responsibility. So this helps them kind of figure out is it the route I should go. Yeah, mm -hmm. this is awesome. 
awesome. Yeah, this is great. All right, so the 2024 Juneteenth Festival is taking place this weekend. This weekend. It is Saturday, June 15th, um, 12 to 5, over on 115th and Halsted. In Halsted. Yeah, the Far South Community Development Corporation, CDC, is the social media handles. FarSouthCDC.org is where you can find more information.